getting to Liam? Or should we call it a night? Actually, no, we're getting into Liam. I want to. I really want to listen to this Liam. If your skin is not thick enough, please exit. All right, we're gonna get very. You feel me? I'm. I'm not gonna voice my opinion. Opinion like if it gets a little too bad for me, because even I'm not that thick skinned. I might say a little something. Lee, all right, because this might get a little, this might get a little crazy, because I want to know what happened. Z Liam Payne calls out Zayn Malik and Gigi Hadid. Oh boy, let's see this clip. Let's see this clip. Boys uh, in the group ever actually come to come to blows? Not almost. No, come to blows, no, but actually. We, we we came we, <laughs> we, 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 we came very close at points. I think it was well known within the band that I don't like taking shit. Right, right. At a certain point, I made it very obvious. I'm not going to tell you how. <laughs> um, and there was one moment where there was an argument backstage, and someone, one ma member in particular, threw me up a wall. So I said to him, if you don't remove those hands, there's a high likelihood you'll never use them again. That is such a British thing to say. <laughs> it's just an awesome thing to say. Wait, what, was, what did he say after that? Okay. <laughs> British thing to say. All right. It's just an awesome okay. thing to say. Wait, what, was, right. what did he say after that? All right. Oh, he just took his hands off. Oh, amazing. Okay. He went from Liam Payne to Liam Neeson yeah. in, like two, in like two seconds. Bye. He's like, I have a very unique. I don't know why you have your hands on me. I have a very That's unique funny. set of skills. That's funny. <laughs> very particular set of skills. That's Mine sounds more like Peter Griffin. I got a very particular set of skills. From Quahog. Dude, do you know? Uh, yeah. No, I, I, I've had. Uh, um, an experience with one of your know. one of your bandmates. Oh, you do. Yeah, and he was fired up. Do you know about Who's, this? Which band mate are we talking about? I reckon, I already think I know, but just throw it, throw it in the mixer. Our boy Zane, Ugh. ex bandmate. Wayne, I should say. Wayne Malik. Wayne. Yeah, man. He he. We were Wayne. in Vegas, and <laughs> well, Wayne. all right. This is like my like secondhand experience. It was Jake's experience with him. Uh, <laughs> You're just living off everyone else's. Yeah, vicariously. Now. Yeah, hell yeah. I'm gonna yeah. start telling these stories in a minute and presenting them on my own. <laughs> I was I was loosely involved, okay. very loosely involved. Something happened where like Jake Jake said hi to, to said hi to Zane, and he felt like your girl just spilled Coca Cola. Yeah, point, point the camera at her, put her oh, on. I, 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 I got to see these. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Oopsie Daisy. He, uh, it's not good for you, anyways. Fuck that. He said hi to Zane, and like Zane, he Jake felt like Zane was disrespectful to him, and he wanted to like say what's up. And so Jake tweeted at him, and then. He was screaming in his hotel room because the rooms were right next to each other. He was, he was, he was, and there was a video of it online. Screaming in his hotel room. I was like, I thought my brother was about to fight Zane. And then Gigi tweeted at Jay calling yeah. him like ugly and irrelevant. And that went that. crazy viral. And you know, Jake and is ugly. Tweet, she tweeted something about. <laughs> but, but he's not irrelevant. Then she tweeted, she tweeted something about get yourself like a respectful man or something. Yeah, yeah. That and one didn't age very well. It didn't age. <laughs> Listen, 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 listen. Before, we, before we go, before we go too deeply into this, there's, there's, there's many reasons why I, I dislike Zane, and there's many reasons why I'll always, always be on his side. If I had had to go through what he went through, through his gro his growth and, and whatever else, you know, your, your parents are very supportive. Very, very. Uh, my parents are overly supportive to the point where it's annoying at times, and they, they don't even <laughs> mind me saying that. And Zane, Zane had a different upbringing in that sense, and. Um, you can't. You can always look at the man for where he is and, and, and say, "Oh yeah, whatever. That guy's a dick, right?" But at the end of the day, once you understand, I thought his what mother was supportive. To to point, and also whether or not he actually even wanted to be there. And also, I'm I'm so misunderstood my, by myself more than anyone. Like I don't know why I'm what I'm doing or why I'm here. It's like 
I yeah. can't sit here and Why pick on him because about... of whatever. And listen, I don't agree with any of his actions. I can't commend some of the things that he's done. I can't be on his side for that. What I can say is I understand and I hope that <laughs> your only hope, hope is that at some point in their life, the person on the other end of the phone wants to receive the help that you're willing to give them. That's all I'll say. That's beautiful. Absolutely. H- how old are you? 28. You're very wise. Very. Do you think, do you think you're... I'm an owl. What's well, empathy? <laughs> <laughs> you're very wise. I'm an owl. <laughs> <laughs> You th- you See how I made myself wise and then the knob in 10 seconds. That's the problem in my life. No, 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 no. That, that, that dichotomy is fantastic. It is. You have to keep people guessing. Never okay. let them know your next move. Are don't you- pigeonhole me. I don't like it. <laughs> I, uh, I don't know. I think I might regret this decision. <laughs>